this you is like the start part sweating of, when you like this I, is the part where I get like hives and I start with the anxiety oh my gosh I cannot believe this happened <laughs> hey guys have you ever had a job interview when you're like they really like me like those guys loved me the interviewers all like Oh my gosh, this is really working out. I mean, I can see you working here. This is gonna be amazing. You're amazing. And then you never hear from him again. Well, here's a story about when I absolutely knew that I was not going to get the job. Picture this. This is before YouTube, before Facebook, before Christmas jammies. Are these Christmas jammies? They are Christmas jammies. Penn was a big fancy news anchor. It was not fancy. Everyone in local news wanted to be in network news. There have been movies about this. Like, I'm going network. I'm going to go network. So Penn gets a meeting with the network. Mm -hmm. ABC News. Very exciting. Our lives are going to change. We're going to move to New York I and mean, have a raise giant our kids there. penthouse. How much did Matt Lauer make? $24 million a year? I mean... Private office? Nope. I mean, okay, never too mind. Soon. Right, so I go in with the guy, the guy who runs ABC News, and like this doesn't normally happen, but we were getting along really well. We were like, he was, I'm, I'm telling you, he was digging it, and it was going <laughs> so, <laughs> yes, he was picking up what I was throwing down. In fact, he liked me so much that in the middle of the interview, he was like, hey, um, Penn, so Diane Sawyer is in the newsroom, and like, if I can get her to meet with you and she likes you, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a sure thing, probably, maybe. Well, and by the way, Diane Sawyer has always been an idol of mine. Mm -hmm. She was one of the first female correspondents on 60 Minutes. It's Diane Sawyer. And GMA yeah. and Nightly News. I mean, Diane Sawyer. So she came into the office. And, Diane Sawyer. Right, and, and she started by saying, hey, I've only got a couple of minutes, but who is this dude, whatever. She comes in, and I have never been on like this in my entire life. I was telling jokes, I was witty, I was intelligent. She was laughing, smiling. She like she said she only had, a, she was like, I only have like a few minutes to, to stay in here, I need to meet this guy. But you know, whatever. That is and, not how they answer your phone. Uh, <laughs> Welcome to the Roaring Twenties. Um, and so, no, but she, so she, but then she was walking by, then she ended up sitting down, like on the couch, and we just shot the breeze for 15 minutes. It could not have gone any better. Was it really going that well, or did you think it was going that well? I mean, I don't know. All I know is I thought she was thinking, if I could read her mind, it was like, Penn Holderness is amazing. I'm writing his name down on my notepad because I'm a journalist. Penn Holderness is amazing. This you is like start sweating of, when you like. This I, is the part where I get like hives and I start with the anxiety. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this happened. I really believe that at 9.58, I had the job. And then 9.59 came when she had to say goodbye and it was like, all I had to do was say goodbye. And so Diane says, Penn, it was really nice to meet you. I gotta get to work. Like, I hope to see you soon. And then my husband says to her, says to Diane Sawyer. As she's walking out the door. Nice to meet you, Barbara. As in Barbara Walters. And I didn't realize I'd done it. As in not Diane Sawyer. Right, so she like, she stiffens up on her way out the door. Um, and then she walks out. So Penn turns to look at this news manager and goes, hey, I thought that went pretty well. And that guy is like, he was just staring at me like, are you aware of what you just did? You just called her Barbara. And I was like, for a second, um, I was like, well, yeah, that's her name, right? <laughs> oh, wait a second. She's like, but he, the, guy, the guy goes, he goes, that is equivalent to you, you just ran a 99 yard touchdown and then on the one yard line, put the football on the ground and poked on it. He actually said that. And then so he went from shock to the guy who was just like, ha 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 ha, you are never getting this job. I mean, to be Diane Sawyer yes. and then to have this guy from North Carolina come up and like, hey, 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 okay, Barbara, and not know your name. I'm sure, do you think that I'm sure that's happened to her before, right? So, like, hasn't that at some point happened to her? Like, they're very similar. They came from a similar time. They have the same number of syllables in their name. No. They both work for ABC. No, I just figured like it was an innocent mistake, and maybe I was like, maybe they'll still call me. No, still waiting for that phone to ring. No. Oh.
Yes, you were correct. Can I say she also that Barbara? Or, no. That uh, see now it's in my head that Diane was incredibly nice. Of course. Diane was incredibly nice, and like no one deserves what I did to them. But also, <laughs> I don't think I will ever mess up that badly when the stakes are that high again in my life, or I hope I don't. Well, that being said, everything happens for a reason. Because if you'd gotten that job, we probably would have moved, and then there wouldn't have been like a Christmas jammies, and we wouldn't have built a, you know, what, whatever in the heck we're doing now. Did I also mention, like, we went to like a, because I knew one of the girls at uh, ABC, and my friends and I went to a Christmas party, because this was in December, over at their house, and this was like two days later. And we walked into the party, and this woman walks up and goes, "Are you the guy who called Diane Sawyer Barbara Walters?" Like they, it, it had circulated. He has become legend. So Diane, if you ever see this, which I'm sure you won't, uh, I'm sorry. She's got way more important things to do. Yes, she Why did. are you apologizing? Because I just love her. I like her too. She was lovely. I just called her the wrong name. So and now here we are. Now here we are. Making videos on the YouTube. <laughs> that worked out for us. <laughs> Bye.